Right guys, it is Boxing Day on the island of Tenerife and what better day to spend your time than doing a cocktail run. We're going to go around like the area surrounding the Passarella Centre uh, and try some cocktails in some of the bars there. And uh, we'll probably choose which one we think is best, eh? If you're new to the channel, I'm Ross. I'm Kate. Across travel we do tourist things and holiday destinations, so if you like what you see, click subscribe down there and do the notification bell. Let's go and get some it's cocktails. It's absolutely free. It is absolutely free, well done. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go and get some cocktails. to party show up looking like a zombie it don't matter nobody stop me i'll be there just tell me where damn i'm a long way home at a split road gotta make a choice to a sober up am i trying to keep it going to be continued or am i trying to lose good night came over now I don't think I wanna leave at a tough week Gotta realize this is what I need Don't got the time to be counting sheep It's too late, I'm in too deep Don't wanna contemplate, overcomplicate this And I made my choice, wanna see what's going on so we started off at Buddy's, but we didn't have a cocktail there, we did have a pint. It's a nice bar, I suppose, isn't it? Yeah. Looks quite nice. Quiet. Yeah, pretty quiet today. But we're going to head over to the Bull and Moon and try some of their cocktails now. Feeling something sugary. Right, scratch that. Bull and Moon don't do cocktails. <laughs> what kind of bar doesn't do cocktails? It's ridiculous. Um, it's busy enough, but yeah, they don't do cocktails, so we're going to head. Should we head up to Chicago's at the Passarella? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to head to Chicago's at the Passarella Centre. We'll see you there. It's not quite any, there's uh, strawberry daiquiris that aren't included apparently, but uh, that's what we've ordered, two strawberry daiquiris, so we'll see what they're like. Yeah. I don't know, here we are though, looks good though. So what did you think of the daiquiris there? Yeah, I mean, I thought mine tasted a bit better as it as it went as it melted. Do you know what I mean? Um, but it's a bit confusing as well because it did say two for any two for one, was it? Two for twelve. That's it. Hi guys, you're right. Um, any two for twelve, and daiquiris weren't included, but it was on the list. Yeah. So that was a bit odd. Um, but that was okay. Yeah. Anyway, I thought I dropped my glasses then, but they're still on my head. Uh, we're going to go up to La Pepper, see if we can get a cocktail up there in the Passarotta Centre, and then we'll head down to Casey's. Well, I think that's a Mexican. Ox, ox sales, is that right? But every time I've been here, it's not open. So is it closed down? I don't know. It's a bit odd. Like it never looks open, the and I've are never. Set with yeah, the tables okay. are all set with glasses on them and stuff. But I've never actually seen it open. If you know, you could drop it in the comments for us. Tell 
So just quickly, before we sample the mojitos, there's a beautiful sunset from up here. Take a look at this. Been feeling trapped down on the floor. I don't know what for. Feels like... Well, I've got to give Kate a lot of credit there. She was her idea to check out up here. And to be honest, she's found a gem. But as she though, because let's try the cocktail, see if it's any good. Have you tried yours? Yeah. Yeah, I have. Yeah? Yeah. Mm. Good one, me. <laughs> <laughs> right, okay. Oh, that is nice. It is strong as well, yeah. It's nice though. Plenty of flavour in that. A lot nicer than the one downstairs at Chicago. Six euros. Yeah, six euros each. And we've got a massive screen. You can see it there. Showing live sports as well. So, yeah, really good. I'm really impressed, darling. Well done. Thank you. You're welcome. Tell you what, that was an absolutely beautiful sunset. The colours of the skies and everything, even just after. Well, some of you. My legs are killing. Why? You haven't walked that much yet. Why are they killing? <laughs> well, but let's head down to Casey's now and see. We're going to see if they've got cocktails, and if they have, we're going to sample one. That's where we had Christmas dinner yesterday. The Olive Garden. An amazing cheese beer soup as well, in case you haven't seen that one. But here's Casey's. Come on. I'm gonna lose. Silence takes a hold. I can't let it go. Chain up, no one knows. But I won't let the stormy seas throw me in open water. Let me have my peace and leave me to tomorrow. Right, so we decided to get two spiced tiki cocktails. It's a Captain Morgan spice rum based cocktail. What's all of you? Cinnamon. Yeah, it's got cinnamon on it. Sprinkled with cinnamon. It's got, was it, lime and apple and pineapple, was it? I think. And a bit of rum. But... I didn't see the cinnamon bit. Yeah, it said sprinkled with cinnamon. Oh, wow, that's really nice. Yeah, it's lovely. Go on, you try yours. Yes. It's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, so this is Casey's bar. What was it? Two for uh, two for twelve. Two for twelve, wasn't it? Yeah. I think I managed to get a shot of the menu anyway, but it's two for twelve. And uh, you have the, the dried fruit. What are you doing? Getting the cinnamon off. <laughs> Disgusting. Just drink it. What's I don't like here? cinnamon. It's not in your drinks, it's on top of it. Yeah, and I'll smell it. Anyway. <laughs> it smells like Christmas. Oh no, the lime's got it, it on. It tastes a bit like Christmas as well. Oh, anyway, there is oh, life. Oh, the ice cube. Oh no. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> Uh, anyway, as I was saying before, you know, the wife started being really dramatic about stuff. <laughs> all live sports here, live boxing, Premier League football, um, you know, they, they show it all as well. And it's a nice bar. It is a really nice bar, actually, in the Passerella Centre. So, uh, when you can get a seat, yeah. I mean, well, this time of year, this time of year, it's, it's been really busy everywhere. Uh, we've been in April before and it's been pretty quiet, to be honest. Uh, but yeah, check cases out. It's a nice cocktail. Things I let go, floating on the way. We go bottoms up, we go all the way. When you're feeling down. 
So Casey's cocktails were actually really nice. Yeah. Well, that one we had. Yeah. Apart from the cinnamon. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Apart from the cinnamon. Yuck. Yeah, we know you hate cinnamon. Um, but yeah, really good cocktails at Casey's. Really good cocktails up at La Pepper. <coughs> Excuse me. Where are we going now? We'll, we'll see what tailors yeah. do. Yeah. Well, we're not going to love India now, are we? We're going to do that <laughs> another day. Um, but we'll see what tailors do, and if not, we'll, we'll be at the vault. So we'll see you down there as well. Quick change of plan. Uh, we found a Highland Paddy. They are everywhere around here, aren't they? And pretty much all over Europe. It must be a chain, but we're going to go over there, see what cocktails they do, see if they're any good. Right, so we got a jug of, what was it, Tropical Sunset. Now it's 7 euros a glass, but for a jug, it's 15. So we decided to go for the jug. That's what it looks like. Only charge me And he only charges, 50, uh, only charges 10 euros. I'm starting to feel a bit tipsy, to be honest. How is it? Yeah. I'm going to go for mine then. Yeah, it does taste very similar to Sex on the Beach, and we've got a celebrity in the house. Ricky Atten is just over there. There you go. So, Highland Paddy, that was nice actually. That jug. That jug of cocktail. Yeah, they did. Yeah, they, they didn't charge us right. They, um, they charge us five euros less than what we uh, should have paid. So 10 euros for a jug. So, Bonus. yeah. Because it was seven euros a glass. Yeah. And, uh, and got two glasses each. And never meet your heroes, I'll say no more. <laughs> <laughs> but right, we're around the corner from the vault, so we'll see what their cocktails are like. Let's take a look. It tastes like that. You don't, so you don't. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. All right, okay. Okay, there's also a live act on, so we'll show you him as well. Um, but cheers, it's the last one of the night. So, yeah, cheers. We'll see you for the outro. So it's the end of the night. Mm. What was your favourite? I'm going La Peppa and their mojito and the views and the prices. All of that adds up to a, a really good cocktail, really, doesn't it? Yeah. I really enjoyed that. <laughs> <laughs> the ball was good as well. I'm feeling a little bit tipsy and we're waiting for a pizza, so yeah. La Peppa was good, um, the vault was good. Casey's was also very, really, really nice. Yeah, I don't, can't think of any that I didn't like, to be honest. No, to so, be honest, it was all good. It was all right. Um, okay. But I'm going to say the pepper for the views and stuff. Okay. And then I just don't have anything for that. <laughs> okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I liked them all. <laughs> if you like the video, don't forget to click like and subscribe down there. It's absolutely free. Follow us on Facebook. And ding the notification bell. It's free. It's free. It's all free. <laughs> right, we'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.